So hi, this is Dave from NFPA, and here I am in Scotland, and I'm going to be doing a few clips about coast survival. And here I am amongst the fishing pots of this very, very quaint little harbour. And I guess these fishing pots behind me just here, they kind of remind us of our coastal heritage. Stone Age man was predominantly a coastal inhabitant. And in the US, you have one of the most successful cultures ever on the planet to have been a successful civilization without the benefit of agriculture. And that's kind of unique because most of the successful civilizations were agricultural based civilizations. But this culture, on the northwest Pacific coast was predominantly hunter-gatherer and they lived on the coast around British Columbia down through into Washington state and here in England we have a fine rich heritage and in Scotland never more so because this is a rugged and wild coast and I'm on the Fife coast in Scotland for a week just to find out about how to live on the coast and when you think about it, it makes a huge amount of sense because most of our ancient cultures have come from a coastal background. They've been hunter-gatherers on the coasts around Europe, around Britain and around the US. Because it's here that we can find some of our most richest of resources. Resources that will allow us to hunt, to gather and to forage to feed our bellies. In fact, so successful were the Indians of the Northwest Pacific Rim. And even those with a little bit of effort by using such things as homemade crab pots and lobster pots will be able to harness some of the ocean's bounty. I'm really excited. This is going to be a great week and Hopefully, I'm going to be able to do some really cool little videos. I apologise, it's night time. I've just arrived here. Um, it's a beautiful summer's evening, and I'm really excited about um, doing some of the stuff I'm going to be doing this week. So this is Dave Connell in Scotland on the Fife Coast for the NFPA, and I'll see you soon.